happy Tuesday. Um, I have, <clears throat> excuse me, a fun little project for you today. We're going to make little teacher gifts. Um, these are little, just little seven by seven canvases. Hey Tara, um, that I got grabbed from Target. And the these this design and the one that I'm going to show you on here um, are all from the It's kind of how my brain is working right now. Um, school is cool um, bundle that we've got going on right now. Okay, so here's the thing. If you guys have worked with Canvas before, I love putting HTV on it, but it's not the easiest thing to do. Oh, we'll get to this in a second. Hang on there. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, so, the, tr the reason being that you obviously, this part is not completely... Um, like it will it's taunt but it's not firm so when you go and you put your heat press on there or I'm gonna use an easy press because I'm gonna tell you why that's actually easier for these little guys um, what you need to do is put something in the back now I literally walked around my house and was like okay what am I gonna put back here um, <clears throat> typically when I have larger canvases I put a book okay usually a book will fill this but this is very small it is I would guess five by five because this whole thing is seven by seven so what I did was cut up a cardboard box um, or a piece of cardboard and I have just four pieces of cardboard um, that are stacked together and I stuck them in the back okay so I had I used four because that made it so that the back was then even all right so I'm going to do that, and that is going to make it so that when you press your heat press, or your easy press in this case, um, down onto it, it keeps this part tight. You can see it's pushing through, okay? All right, so I'm going to pull you down a little bit down here so you can see better. Don't mind this awkward angle. Um, and, okay, get that all stacked up. Then you're going to take your design. So this one is also from the school is cool all right and you're just going to place it right on your canvas now here's the thing um i got to turn this around so i make sure i do it evenly so i mean i make sure it's level okay this is why i like htv because you can kind of fiddle with it to make sure um that you've got it in the right spot okay so now that it moved so with the easy press i'm using this um, you can get this at Swing Design. You can get it a couple other places. If you get it from Swing Design, um, they, there's a coupon you can use to get 10% off, and it's free shipping because they have free shipping always over $35. So Tara, my lovely Tara, will share the um, coupon code, and she's going to share the link where you can get these designs and everything. But you also want to get one of these silicone heat press um, replacement cover replacement pads and you need that when you use the easy press to make sure that you've got some give on your surface okay all right so you actually don't need to use the teflon sheet when you're using the easy press so you're going to put it there i have it set to 315 degrees 30 seconds now you are going to place it directly on there do not forget to press the timer and then you do need to put some pressure on there okay don't just um i mean i've got a little pressure here all right so 30 seconds as long as you press the little um button the timer will start otherwise you better start counting all right and this the reason i like using the heat the easy press for canvases like this is because you can press flat down when you're using, and I'll show you in a second, I don't want to lift it up, but if you're using a heat press, you obviously have the, the heat press lid coming down like this, and you don't always get an even press on a canvas because the bottom is flat, but the top can't completely go down. There's So this is nice because you can go flat down onto it. Okay, so then you've got your design on there, and you're going to make sure that it has stuck, all right, before you slowly peel up the transfer um, sheet and you're all done isn't that cute so I quickly like I said the trick to this is this cardboard in the back to give you a nice firm um, back support while you are putting your um, HTV on there and then you can obviously just keep using those so here I've made three you could put like a little ribbon on there if you wanted um, or you could just give it just like this super cute for a teacher's desk office or whatever um, 
So they're all, and these, I literally did nothing to these designs except bring them in after I downloaded from So Fancy and um, just sized, all right? I made a seven by seven square in Silhouette Studio. You could do the same thing if you're using Cricut or whatever. Um, seven by seven to make sure that the size was correct. And then I just cut on um, Caesar Easy Weed. And then here's another one. This also, this design is also in the School is Cool bundle. Um, obviously, it doesn't have to be for school, but could definitely apply if it was, you know, first day of kindergarten, first day of uh, college, whatever you want. All right? All right, guys. So, that's that. Um, head over, grab that bundle. It's for a limited time. If you're interested in getting the Easy Press, um, you can get it. Like I said, Tara will throw up the link for you. I'll throw up the links for everything at the top of this post, but you should find stuff in the comments for right now. All right? All right, guys. Have a good one. I'll see you soon.